I got a summer URG to study women objectifying women. Paris to study Gothic architecture. Long commute in Bolivia. Economic opportunities for refugees in camps in Ethiopia. Physical theater in Chicago. Munich, Germany. Log concave probability measures. The development of the artistic and creative voice. To study the music dual degree program at Northwestern University. I did interviews with everybody and their mothers, literally. I did interviews with the participants, current, past, their parents, mothers, uh, brothers, sisters, fathers. I did interviews with also the organizational side of it, so not only the executive director and the staff members, but also the board members. And I really looked at all the different stakeholders who had interest and had uh, were involved with the program in some ways. I came up with a coding scheme, and after lots of interviews, I probably did about 40 of them in Spanish with uh, everybody, I was able to compare the themes that came up in both and come up with what came up most. Qualitative research, I think, is a really interesting way to sort of look at humans and how they operate, which is very much tied to anthropology, but it's something that I'll never get tired of doing. It was a great learning experience. Um, it was very chaotic, but it was probably the single greatest learning experience I've had at Northwestern. I had to organize the entire trip logistics on my own, reach out to all these people, make my own contacts, establish a network on the ground. And then once there, it was really just kind of shamelessly asking for help, putting a lot of effort and time into just relationship building with the staff members at these nonprofits and at the UN, and getting to talk to the refugees and make up my own interview questions and figure out what was kind of the unique, interesting thing to learn about the camp dynamics. First, I made a a Qualtrics survey that addressed questions pertaining to how much you use technology, opinions about technology, and I sent it out to people within the age range. It wound up being like 14 to 22, I think, was my age range. And then I just went through that to make sure I was getting at the right question. My project was on the objectification of um, women and how women objectify other women. Traditionally, men have been conceptualized as the main objectifiers of women. However, there's been some recent evidence which suggests that women also objectify other women. And so I kind of wanted to start teasing out the situations in which that may or may not happen. It was a really fabulous experience to work so closely with one professor, um, Renee Engel, in the psychology department because it allowed me to focus in on something that I wouldn't otherwise have been able to do. Mm -hmm.